In this video, we're going to show you how to perform the cascade configuration on an easy screen system. Make sure that your system is connected up with power. Make sure that you have the orange and the orange black wire tied together. Make sure you isolate the black and the white wires and have the violet wire available to do a reset of the system. Remove the security tab on the first receiver in the string and open the access door. Set the dip switches for the following arrangement, leaving the first and the last dip switches alone. Dip switch needs to be to the left, to the right, to the right, and to the left. Reset the system with power or the reset line. Once that's done, you should have a number and a letter showing in the first receiver. In this case, we show a 2C. The second receiver shows a 1C. If you have additional receivers, they will also show 1C. Now we need to move the dip switches back to a run condition. In this case, we're gonna move them back to trip, off, trip, off. And now reset the system or cycle power. You will now either have a dash showing that your system is running or a CH1, which indicates that you're not aligned. You've now set the configuration on the easy screen. If you're configuring the EasyScreen LP system, the wiring remains the same, the configurations remain the same, the only difference is the location of the dip switches.